Welcome to another episode of Box Wine. Uh, why Box Wine, you ask? Because we're doing an unboxing video of this month's Loot Crate DX, and we're drinking wine. Cheers. This one is actually new. What is it called? Cafe Zinfandel or something? Something of that nature. Something. I'm just. So this you poured it, so and you opened it, so you you needed to know that one. But um, this month's Luke Crate DX is a uh, Guardians, and so we will see. A Guardians in the Galaxy. Yes, just, I think yeah, so. One or two items, maybe of that, and then like just other Guardians. Like I forget what was in the. Like the Goonies, was in the Luke Crate. Oh, you guys. <gasps> Oh, oh, that is super sweet. I'm kind of jealous. Yeah, I, yeah. I, yeah. I have to. That is so, really cool. I didn't even know this was a thing, and now I officially oh, want them all. Oh, that is really cool. This is DC Comics Bombshells. It's Catwoman, Wonder Woman, Harley Quinn, but obviously we have Wonder Woman. That is super cool. Metallic Edition. I'm kind of that is like, awesome. Can I see it? I am so jealous of you right now. <laughs> I would actually have been happy with any one of those. But Wonder Woman is awesome. I can't. This is a thing. I didn't even know there was a thing. Here's the back to show you the other ones. Metallic edition. That is really cool. So she's got all the the shiny emblems, yeah. other it than the yellow, bright. which would be if you had a wow. That's that is cool. Super Way cool. to go, guys. And then uh, of course, uh, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Two, Qfig of Star Lord. Didn't we get the last box? Didn't. When had I, a Q fig in it, yeah, because yeah. the rocket raccoon was a uh, Q fig. With yep. Groot. So now we have yeah, Star we Lord. Together. We're and excited. he's flying. He's flying. Yeah, okay. We get the last two. Then. Okay, so then, of course, the shirt. Destiny is what it says on the back. Is this a Halo? Please tell me it is. Destiny. It's. A, I know it's a game. You can't see it, really. Yeah, it's like like. I think black it's Halo. On. It's a it's a black on gray, so it's really kind of hard to see. I think it's see. Halo. It looks but if cool, you know it, you'll yeah, know you'll it. be like, oh. I like, think okay, it's Halo. Cool. That works. No, it's Destiny. Yeah, it's okay. a it's a game. Um, and then we have the complete Marvel Cosmos with notes by Guardians of the Galaxy Hidden Universe travel guides. And it, like. The getting around. Tips for a fun trip. What to wear. Etiquette. <laughs> Cute. Earth, New York so City. So it's like the backstory. Like, that is really cool. That is actually pretty cool. Like, I'd be interested to read that. Yeah, if you are like a nerd fan, like that would be a really cool item. Well, obviously. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then we have a Destiny May 2017 Guardians pin. Uh, pin. To go with the t-shirt. With a double back. Yeah. And then the box. Go forth, Guardian. Yeah, this one, I mean, though two figures, but I'm kinda I feel a little cheesed on this one. Like, you know I think the shirt did it for me. Like the pin, okay, cool. The book, I think that's great. The bombshells, love. Yeah. Two figs, always great. But the shirt, I think, is what I'm... I, I like all of this, but not... Yeah. This is my disappointment. And obviously, we love to wear them. So, right. that would be... Sorry, my biggest thing is we don't do video games, but if you like the video games, that's... Me! Cool. That makes sense, <laughs> yes. So, the Complete Marvel Cosmos Travel Guide, narrated by the crew of the Milano, the Guardians of the Galaxies, uh, assist as tour guides, taking you through Marvel's actual universe, with the films expanding even further into space, you'll have a leg up in all the places we'll see. That's cool. And then the uh, Destiny Ghost Pin. Feel like a guardian every day with this month's pin depicting the very first ghost you activate in Destiny. It may not be able to scan relics, but it may give you a boost on your everyday journeys. Mm -hmm. it, actually, if you turn like uh, the loot crate, which I actually did today, into like the item that it's supposed to be, it looks like this. Oh, cool. The Destiny thing. So if you actually, if you get the crate and you turn your box into the thing, it looks like that. It's like a little star. Oh, you remember we got the stars? That's what it looks like. Correct. So then Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, Star-Lord Q-Fig, figurine, timed exclusive. 
A cosmic hero deserves a big figure, and who deserves one more than what's his name again? Oh yes, Star Lord. Peter Quill is rocking his outfit from um, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Two in this detailed Q Fig Max figure that you get before anyone else. So it will come out um, in stores, but this they get ahead of time. Uh, the Wonder Woman DC Bombshells figure exclusive. DC Bombshells has been a big success taking DC's female characters and making them the center of World War II super heroics. In anticipation of Diana's first live action feature film, it is a nod to her origins. We present this 7 inch metallic variant figure to stand proudly on your desk, table, or mantle. And the Destiny t shirt. Exclusive. The Traveler may not have given you a Guardian's power, but you can still channel your inner light to fight the darkness and look stylish while you're doing it. Whether you're a hunter, titan, or warlock, you can always rep the last city with this subtle but bold, so they, they went for that on purpose, uh, T featuring graphics of the, on the front and back. Because like I said, it's a destiny across the back. Uh, Guardians DX says here in the little fold up, here's to those that answer the call to stand up and protect others to do what's right, not just what's easy. This month we salute the Guardians of pop culture with heroes from the past, present, and future. Okay. Does this say anything about Mega Crate? No. Just Mega Crate, Luke Crate, Mom. Yes. What was your favorite? Bombshells. Yeah. Hands down. Now, like, Chad said one of his items was broken. I bet it was this. Because you could see if it was. Yeah, and I and I bet you like because it looks like that's kind of a small amount. You know, like for the thing. Yeah. Yeah. Probably got what was your favorite? What was your favorite, Samantha? The bombshell. Like, okay. This this book is really cool. I'm usually not a fan of like the books and the comics and stuff, but this being like a guide, I think it'd be is, fun. It's kind of fun. That is kind of fun. It, I I agree with the t-shirt. Like I understand it's subtle, but like we don't get it. That's really our thing. My the whole point of wearing a nerdy t-shirt is so that it's obvious. So that, you know, people around you can be like, oh, you right. know, you know, and start a conversation. And so it's like, this is like, I like my nerd loud and proud, not stealthy. Right. Yeah. Like, I'm I'll, I'll let my freak play fly. <laughs> my, <laughs> me. my favorite was the cute You think you like Star Lord? Yeah, but it should have had a back holding it because... You know, it's supposed to give it that galactic look without being weighted. Mm -hmm. So I, I totally but get almost that. Almost like he's suspended in air. So let us know, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. This is Crimson Shell. If you watch or not watch her, but if you like her on Instagram, she has a whole bunch of cool stuff on there. Yep. A video of me running. Truth. Now that's worth watching. Just posted today. Um, and then this is your cutie IYQ on Instagram and Samantha Shevlin, which obviously you are watching. Guys, always be pe cool. Girls, stay pretty. Aw, very nice. <laughs> Boys, stay handsome. Aw, that's Bye, guys. Bye. Bye.